I've been called a lot of racist and derogatory shit in my life. Wetback, spick, beaner. Hell, someone even thought I was Middle Eastern and called me a sand N-word. But this, this is a first for me. And for those that don't know, a sambo is a derogatory term for somebody of mixed African and indigenous ancestry. Hell, I don't even know how many times I've been told to go back to where I came from, even though I am indigenous to this land. My family is indigenous to this land. And you had the nerve to call me a bigot. All because I didn't agree with what your definition of racism was. Because you wanted to say that only black people can experience racism and people of color, other people of color, only experience discrimination. If you had done some research on my fucking platform, you would know my entire platform is about calling out white supremacists, racists, misogynists. But just because you're black, you don't get a fucking pass. You also had the nerve to ask when was the last time a Mexican got George Floyd? Meet Mario Gonzalez Arenales. He died a year after George Floyd. And the cases were almost identical. He was standing in a parking lot, talking to himself, looking suspicious or intoxicated. The cops were called and instead of calling an ambulance to come check him out, they tried to restrain him. And since he was a little bit of a bigger dude, he couldn't get properly handcuffed behind his back. And they thought he was resisting arrest. So they threw him to the ground and they put their knees on his neck and his back. They restrained him for five minutes while he was screaming he couldn't breathe. And you know what the difference between his case and George Floyd's was? His murderers weren't charged for his murder. They got off scot-free. You know, it's been so fucking disappointing the last few days because I defend black people on this app all the fucking time. And the moment I defended black Latinos, it became a fucking issue. People literally told me I could not speak on the subject because I was not black, even though I'm a Latina. I've never once weaponized my African ancestry. I've never called myself black because I know people would turn around and say, you're not black. You can't speak on this shit. And they did. Now I know it's not all or most because I don't generalize an entire group of people. So I will continue to use my platform to speak out against racists and bigots like your ass. And one last thing in my comments, you said, that that case that I just spoke about was over a year ago. More black people have been killed since. So have Latinos. But yeah, I'm the one who lacks empathy. And I'm the bigot, huh? Fucking crazy. You could have the fucking day you deserve.